Hello, my name is Matias Cavodi. I'd like to welcome you guys to my channel. Today, we're going to talk about a particular story arc that I, I just made a video where I rant how much I didn't like Decimation in general. But this particular story arc that comes from Decimation, like you can see words in Spanish. I live in Argentina, so X Men is called Patrusa X. So we have this story with Phoenix, Rachel Summers, uh, which I'm. I only have the last one. Uh, just, I, my comic book collection is a mess, so I can't find all the issues. But this final issue, is it does a fantastic job in just showing off what went down in the story in general. Basically, the Shi'ar send this group. We have the Imperial Guard. They're like the Justice League of the Shi'ar. They're insanely powerful. But we discover that they have sort of have a kill crew, a, kill, a group of commandos that do black op missions. And they're really messed up. And their mission is to go to Earth and kill off uh, Jean Grey's family. They, they're they going to kill off the, so no one else can be born with that potential of having the Phoenix Force in them. So these Shi'ar dudes, whom the first time I saw them, I said, oh, they're going to be knockoff villains. We're never going to see them again. Uh, oh, this story is actually written by Chris Claremont, too. And art by uh, Chris Buchalo. I thought these guys were going to be knockoff villains, but happily, we do get to see them a couple more times after this. They're sort of like mainstays in the Shi'ar part of the Marvel Universe. And the moment we see them in this particular story, I forgot to mention, this is X Uncanny X-Men 468. So they've killed off most of Jean Grey's family already by this point. Jean Grey's mother is the last person standing, and Rachel. Rachel's doing her best trying to stop these guys and uh there's one really heartbreaking moment where rachel summer is trying to save the grandmother and she's just really angry over this whole situation and it's like xavier brought hell to my life mutants have not brought anything good my family's dead my daughter's dead rachel summers please go away this is all your fault and it's freaking brutal like chris claremont did a really fantastic job because this just this part where i'm telling you about gene gray's mom it's heartbreaking the way it's written it's a freaking good story and i'm really pissed off i can't find out find the other two issues so the x-men finally arrive and in one last moment the the leader of the cr kill crew kills off the grandmother's like okay we're not going to be able to take you down because you're too powerful but just in case pow, and they shoot the grandmother <laughs> it's so messed up and you feel really bad for Rachel Summers. Like she, it's like one of the one of the ex characters that's gone through the most bad things in their lives. It's like she's been really miserable with some little nice moments, but she's had it really rough. So this is a really good story that I just really spoiled for you guys. But Chris, Chris Claremont did a really good job. Like in his later years, like he would drop the ball, and some of the stories weren't the best. But this one which is really brutal and super dark. He really did a good job for it. And it's part of Decimation, which I really hated in general. So hope you guys like this video and see you guys next time. Bye.